my friends. Today's sentence analysis lesson is on subject and predicate. This is our first lesson on subject and predicate. So you're probably saying, what's the subject? What's the predicate? Well, the subject is the person or thing that is being discussed or described in your sentence. The predicate is the part of a sentence that contains the verb and state something about the subject. So let's have a look at the two sentences I have right here. My first sentence says, Christopher cooked chicken noodle soup. Now remember, the first thing we're looking for is our verb. So I know that in this sentence, Christopher cooked chicken noodle soup, our verb is cooked, because that is the action. So I'm gonna cut out cooked, and I'm going to put cooked onto the verb. There we go, Chris, so he cooked, that we know. Now we wanna know who is it or what is it that? We know it is Christopher that. That makes Christopher our subject. He is who is it that cooked? Now our direct object is who or what was cooked? We know Christopher cooked. Who or what did Christopher cook? We hope it's not a who. But in this case, we know he cooked chicken noodle soup. That is our direct object. So Christopher cooked chicken noodle soup. Let's try one more. I'll move my sentence up here out of the way. Our second one, my cat Hadley chased a mouse. Remember, the first thing we wanna do is figure out what the verb is. The verb is always in action. Chased is our action in this sentence. So let me cut out the word chased. Making sure to cut it carefully. So here's our verb, chased. Now we wanna ask ourselves, who is it that, or what is it that? My cat Hadley, that what? Or it could be who, that cut, that chased. My cat Hadley chased. Who or what did Hadley chase? Hadley chased a mouse. Hadley is our subject because that is what this sentence is talking about. We are discussing Hadley. Chased is our verb because that is our action. And the direct object is a mouse because that is what Hadley chased, a mouse. Alrighty, my friends, you get to go and work on this paper right here. Please read the directions, complete these sentences, and answer the questions at the bottom. I look forward to seeing your work. Goodbye, my friends.